I'm a victim of the worst kind of exploitation, child porn. She says she was raped as a child. The images remain on the internet to this day. Every day, people are trading and sharing videos of me as a little girl being raped. A story she's making public through the Canadian Centre for Child Protection. I can never feel safe so long as my images are out there. Every time they're downloaded, I'm exploited again. We are here to announce a groundbreaking new tool that detects and reduces child sexual abuse images online. It's called Arachnid, a web crawling software which scours the internet for images already identified as illegal. The agency that developed its cyber tip says in six weeks, it's found 41,000 images of 1,100 unique victims on 5.1 million websites. What's worse, it's still finding pages faster than it can process them. 760,000 are still waiting in the queue. This is a growing problem and we're now playing catch up as it relates to this. Um, so there's a lot of work ahead of us. When an image is found, authorities are notified. But as fast as one image may come down, it can be replaced, often multiple times. This expert says automation is the only way to catch up. For folks that are hosting or distributing this illegal material, you know, it, they should become scared at a whole new level. Still, the technology is limited. Its size, its speed, and the ever-evolving nature of the internet. Is this the silver bullet to the problem of child abuse material on the inter internet? Absolutely not. But are we doing something about it? Yes. Of the images found so far, it's unclear how many have come down. That depends on compliance from local internet service providers and law enforcement. Cameron McIntosh, CBC News, Winnipeg.